This is what you might have missed on BCSN's Sports Nightly. Central Catholic with a late start to the season due to football. Irish 2-0 in the league as they visited St. Francis tonight. For the story on this one, here's Eric Hauber. All right, guys, another rivalry game for St. Francis. You know what happened against St. John's? Wasn't very pretty for the Knights, but they were focused tonight going up against the Central Catholic Fighting Irish. Last year's performance. Standing room only tonight at the pit. Jamar Parker with six first quarter points for Central. His 11 would lead the Irish, but that was about it for the good news from Central Catholic. We're tied to start the second quarter, but the Knights go off. Kevin McVicker sparks the frenzy with the jam. And then John Burnham lit it up from outside the arc, and he would not let up. Four triples in the first half. Burnham for three again. Yes! John Burnham's hot here. Even one from the logo. Why not? Again! And how about Burnham on D for the block? There's a block by Burnham. Irish try to get going, but this kind of night, Zach Hoover rejected by the rim on the dunk. Knights up 31-19 at half. Second half, more of the same. Uh-oh, can't leave him open. Burnham on fire! John Burnham finishes with six three-pointers, leading all scores with 22, and St. Francis wins big, 55-32. Have you ever been that hot? In a St. Francis uniform. No, not gonna, not that I can remember, but every night's a different night and a new night, so you never know. Did you want the ball? Was it one of those deals where you felt it and you wanted it? Oh yeah, once once you hit two or three, you kind of you start winning the ball, and Kenny did a great job of getting all the shooters, not just me, getting Marcus Lang and Drew Swirline, getting us the ball, and he got us wide open shots, so we we're just putting them in. All right, joined now by my broadcast partner, Rhett Boyd, the coach and coach. What we saw from John Burnham tonight was impressive. Absolutely, and it's what he does best is he can shoot the basketball from behind the arc and he can score in bunches, and we saw that tonight. Once he hit the first two right in a row, it snowballed from there and positive momentum, not only for him, but for his whole basketball team. And what does it say about St. Francis being able to respond after such a tough loss to St. John's and do it against another rival? Well, it talks about the character that these kids and Coach Lewis and his coaching staff have to be able to rebound against a tough loss in a rivalry game to bounce back. Maybe playing Central tonight in a rivalry game was the best thing for him. An impressive performance by the Knights. Be sure to watch Sports Nightly weeknights at 10.30 on BCSN and follow us on Twitter at sports underscore nightly.